What's going on guys? If you guys are looking for a fed four bedroom, three bath, over 3,000 square foot home, this is it. My name is Hector Hernandez, your local realtor here in San Antonio. And if you guys like seeing new homes and tours, don't forget to subscribe. Today we are out here in the beautiful hill country of San Antonio on 1604 North and I-10. The address is 3934 Cimarron Route, close to going towards Bernie. And we are at this beautiful property. It's four-sided brick, built in 2011 by Perry Home. And this property currently is listed at $600,000. So let me go ahead and show you guys what that gets you in San Antonio. Let me get you guys to see what you can do. We'll see that it's brick. We have stone in the front. A lot of lighting, lots of windows. There is a two, two uh, door garage, right? Two car garage doors or whatever here, but it's a tandem garage, so there's a uh, there's a the one on the right is elongated, so there's an extra room in there for you to put the extra third car. Yes, sir, this is it. Let's go ahead and show you on the side just to see a better idea. Neighbors are kind of close on here, but there's tons of trees, there's tons of things we can do for privacy. It has an upgraded HVAC system, it has a water heater. So let's go ahead and go in there, guys, to see what all this is about. Sorry guys, as you can see, we're greeted by high ceiling, tile on the floor. This was the formal dining room and they converted it into their formal living room or another formal living room. We can go in here. We'll see the floor doesn't match, it's the kitchen floor. So we have a beautiful kitchen, we'll be over there in a few minutes. Let me show you here the formal dining room that they turn into a formal living room. And then across the hall we have our office, the furniture and the household items convey in the center lights for this property. So everything you see here will convey if you're interested. These shelves are not attached. I want to show you the crown molding all around the top and also the crown molding all around the bottom. The office. The floors do not match from here to there, so that might be something we can work on, but they're both beautiful. The tile floor is the original, and as you guys know, in 2011, this home had a carpet, so they went ahead and replaced the carpet with some laminate flooring. Down the first hallway, as soon as we walk in, we'll have a Laying in closet towards the end and a room here at the right. Here needs two boys' room. Here at the right. You can have a ceiling with a molding all around. And we're going to hit the closet. On this end, we'll see room number two. You can have ceiling, molding, and the closet. It's very size. Okay, slowly. Let's go ahead and take you to the bathroom number one. So I showed you two bedrooms and one bath. This is the original tile. Two bedroom, one bath here. And again, we go back to the main entrance. To the right, with our entrance, how it looks. High ceilings. And to our left, we have access to the rest of the property that way. There's also an entrance on this way, to get on this way. This way we have our garage to the right and our laundry room here to our left. Again, appliances come away. That's our kitchen, we have a beautiful kitchen. Beautiful kitchen before I take you in there and walk you in there. I'll show you the garage, please excuse the property in here, but I just want to show you how the third garage look, or the three-car garage looks in here. All right, let's, now let's go into the kitchen. We have a beautiful island, lots of cabin space, lots of countertop space. These drawers have organizers. Beautiful arches here, recess can lighting.
and dishwasher, water. Right. I'm just saying we have more space. Microwave oven, gas. You have a pull out trash can on this end. Here we have a breakfast nook area. You can beautiful ceilings high. And then this area we have. They're using currently as a media room. Lighting 24 7 on this one here. Alright, so this is the dry living room. Again, plenty of light to come in. Gas fireplace. Now we're on this side of the kitchen. We're going to go ahead and to go take you to room number three. Room number three actually has its own private bath. Again, ready seatings, crumb only, and the private bath for number three. Currently has a full size bed. So it's a good size room. Here is our bedroom number two and the closet for this room. High ceilings. Right, we'll walk out like again where we create to the kitchen. We have our living room here to the left. And to the left there are living room from our master. Which it looks like what's gonna look like when we walk out of the master. We have a master 21 by 14 feet. So again, we have ceilings, lots of lighting, lots of lighting. The house is facing north, so the south, it'll be beautiful weather in the back. All right, here it is. The master bathroom, the master room. We have a stand up shower. Oh, sorry guys. We have a stand up shower here. The garden tub. Here we have the remote, big size walk-in closet. High ceiling from this one also. We have a double vanity seat here. And private seat. Let's try to show you guys. That's how we get from the outside, but let me take you in there so we won't be guessing on it. Alright, beautiful outside. We have a covered patio. We have professional landscaping. We have some fruit trees, some oak trees, some fern trees, some hackberry trees. So, we have it all, guys. Check this one out. Can light in. On the patio. See them stay quiet so you can hear the piece. Alright, we'll go ahead and step back out here and show you a better idea. Again, professional landscaping guys. Let me show you a little bit. Preview back here. The house. All side brick. French drains, gutters. There's some fruit trees. Finger system, guys. Look at this beautiful home. Well, he's on this way. Just so I can show you that on the side of the house, there are also some oak trees. As you can see there. There's four oak trees on that side, guys. There's going to be plenty of shade. I'll show around noon. 
currently at 5.30. It's around noon, the plenty of shade here. So I guess we're not having a problem and it seems like the shade is just growing. But all right guys, if you have a question about this house or any other house, please let me know. Thank you.